And we're counting down the hours until the Oscars tomorrow on ABC 10 and celebrating the great films and actors who will be highlighted. One of them being an Oscar nominee who grew up here in Sacramento. ABC 10's Marcus Allen joins us live from Hollywood, Hollywood where Best Actress nominee Jessica Chastain will soon be gracing the red carpet. You know, they always say, don't bury the lead, so I'm just going to jump out of the gate. Jessica Chastain, El Camino High School graduate, is going to take home the Oscar for Best Actress tomorrow night. Think about it. She's been nominated three times, two times for Best Actress, one time for Best Supporting Actress, and this is going to be her year. A lot's taking place here at the 94th Annual Academy Awards. The spirit is in the air. People are just glad that the world seems to be opening up again and that they can do it for the first time in two years. Back to Jess uh, Jessica. She's going to win because of all of these reasons. Take a look. Nominees for performance by an actress in a leading role. The suspense is mounting. Wait for it. Jessica Chastain in the eyes of Tammy Faye. That's the very moment Jessica Chastain, the pride and joy of Sacramento from El Camino High School, became for the second time an Academy Award nominee. I've had the pleasure of talking to her about her movies through the years, like her first nominated performance almost 10 years ago in Zero Dark Thirty, also movies like The Martian, It, and Interstellar. And more recently, this nominated performance for The Eyes of Tammy Faye, where she talked about so, playing the faded televangelist. You, what did you have in common with her? What, what did you discover? That's just the thing that you, that what you're saying that's kind of hitting the nail on, uh, the, on the head for me, is that everyone who met her said she was a kind soul. The people who knew her said she was so loving and generous and funny and just so full of life. But more recently this year, we got to dig in about her life in Sacramento. Do you ever miss it? Do you know what? Let me ask you this, because there's things that I wonder if it's still there. I miss Old Town, because I loved Old Town. It'll always That's, be there. Yep. Is the River City Brewing Company there? Why, well, yes, it is. The We're beer at the River City Brewing Company. I mean, mwah. <laughs> Shout out. And also, the uh, the last time we talked, I think you mentioned something about the music circus. They want to yeah. know if you remember what show you saw there. Yeah, it was Joseph and the Amazing Technicolor Dreamcoat. Ooh, awesome. And then I also did Christmas Carol two years in a row at Sacramento Theater Company. I played Mar Martha Cratchit or Mary Cratchit. I don't remember the character's name. And I used to work at the Lucky Cafe. There was a diner called the Lucky Cafe. So I'm all over Sacramento. <laughs> Sacramento's all about you, Jessica Chastain. All eyes on ABC 10, the Oscars, Sunday, March 27th for your big win. Hello, Mother. This is Jim Baker, my husband. She's so good in that almost unrecognizable. I think she's going to take home the gold tomorrow night right here on ABC 10. Uh, this is literally the calm before the storm that is the Oscars. Huge difference tomorrow night. In absence of a host the last few years, now we have three. Regina Hall, Wanda Sykes, Amy Schumer. Amy Schumer tweeting that she's pretty much preparing by drinking. So I think it's going to be an interesting night to say the least. Not to mention the fact that right when they round this corner before they get in, go in, there's going to be a lounge that I think throws shots at them right before they go up. This is new for for the very first time, right before they make that turn, you're going to see interviews in front of that. Uh, it's a six-foot replica of the Oscar in gold. You've seen other Oscar artifacts through the years, but never a fully gold-plated, minted by the same company that creates the Oscar statue. So they'll be standing by that, and we'll be standing by it as Jessica Chastain wins. Am I right? Well, we're Back rooting for her here, Mark. All right, thank you so much.